Alright my new back to new world, how are you doing? People of Eternal, I'm hoping you are having a great and wonderful time in this game. But if you do not, it's probably because of one of this error. Log and log, suspicious software or corrupted install detected. And it is a headache for so many people. It became a headache for me twice before and it's just annoying. I already have made this video about how to fix these kind of errors if you haven't watched it go watch it maybe one of those tricks will help you and you won't have to do this but this one is actually even easier it's it's nothing you won't have to uninstall game and then install it back and all that jazz there is a really easy fix i came across this fix last time when my game was had this problem i was talking to the amazon support and uh, it was a great guy i don't i forgot his name but he and I, we went through a couple of things, the fix the errors, and then finally we were able to fix it. I found how to fix the solution. Typically, when this error occurs, your ESE will block your game and won't let you install. You just go in, you play for 5 minutes, and then this error occurs, and then you're, you can't do anything else. It keeps on happening. So, one of the things you have to do is, of course, you have to go to Steam, like this. New, new library, new world, press on the settings, go to properties, local files and you verify integrity of the game. I won't do it because my game is working all fine. You verify integrity of the files, but this will do two things. First of all, if there is a game file corrupted, it will fix it and hopefully your problem will be solved without any further stuff. If it does not work, we need to do another thing, which is you will, another typical thing you will see for this error to get fixed. Is probably when this error happens there will be one file that will be failed to validate and the steam will say it's re getting the file and after two or three seconds uh, it's gonna say everything is fine go and play the game however if when you go to play a game nothing happens back again that same error you come again you keep on verifying it, the files and it's keep on happening you will see one thing is reoccurring there is always one file that is corrupted but steam is not able to fix that file so in order to fix that file we have to find it and we have to delete that file completely so that steam can regather that file in order to fix the problem that fixed it my problem so that's what we're going to do right now normally there is no way to actually know specifically what kind of file was corrupted in steam so but for new world we have a trick what you have to do is go to your search bar or you have to press the window button and hard button. The window button is present on your keyboard on the right side of control. That should be bottom left corner of your keyboard. You press that and with that you press R. It will come up with this window. You have to write percentage, app, data. Some of you might already know how this works. You press OK and it will take you to your app data files which typically contains the uh, games and their functions and some of the other programs, they say files and stuff. What you have to do is you have to go to app data folder, you have three folders, you, have, you go to local, AGS, new world and here you will see two files, you got the game and you got the log backups. Normally your latest instance of the game gets recorded on this file. So whenever you will have a problem with your game, typically it will come here and you will see errors of something like this. This is the file when my game was corrupted. I was I picked it up from the log backups and yet you can see it will come here. You will see something like this. Uh, warnings. These not warnings are pretty normal. However, just like this. Error line, disconnect, blah blah blah. Report reasons, game connection, 56 and until the porch this is all the reasons or whatever you don't have to worry about them but this file you can get directly from here this one or you come here into log backups you press on date notified once or twice so that from top to bottom you got all the list so you have to find that instance for example whenever your game was broken or the problem happened you find you remember that exact time and then you open up that file whatever you for me it was uh, this instant of the game this file was 22 february 23 
and the time was 7 to whatever you just open one of these files that happened that was recorded after your game got the error of login block once you have found the file what you got to do is come in here and you have to look at it if this if the file is having this thing that means it's one of the file that got banned or whatever what you have to do is extremely easy you just have to come here and then you have to find scroll up scroll up until you see this easy anti cheat this thing this is our fix you will see unknown file version assets data crm part 25. this is the exact file that is actually corrupted that's what we that's what to, we need to delete this is so easy i don't know why new world does not tell you that this this is you can do this this works however you have to see the name of the file assets data strm part 25 that's this file was corrupted for me you might your file might be something different but you see this data name and then we got to do is go to new world and actually delete the file so in order to do that we come back to steam we come properties local files and we go browse now we're in the steam folder of the new world what do we have to do here the folder we have to see path the path was assets so we go into the assets folder and then we have to look for this file data strm part 25k which is over here this file was corrupted for me so i just what you have to do is delete that file completely don't worry when you verify steam it will reinstall it you find this file okay you will have deleted this file then what you do is you just end up get out of everything you uh, exit steam and possibly you should restart your pc for the system to detect any file is missing so you restart your pc you come back and then the only thing you could do is properties local files and just verify and the wgn file the game will detect there is a file missing and it will download the whole one gigabyte file and once that is done the game will work it worked for me twice it should work for you if it does not work maybe try one of the other methods that you can see in the other video if it still does not work if you're still having a problem go to comments down section write your problem i will personally help you as soon as i see that comment i will personally help you you can join my discord i will put a link in the bottom for the tactical noobs and also I will link, link in the bottom the other channel that we have i go there and subscribe to that we sometimes upload good things also I will be uploading way more of these videos so if you want to see how to make gold and how to be a great mage in new world and a lot of other shenanigans of new world or possibly a lot of the other games please sub like subscribe and uh, share the video with your friends hopefully your game works and you have a good time bye